Welcome back. Hot off the presses. Literally just a minute ago, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued for parts of Henry and Patrick counties because of the cell that we were tracking not more than five minutes ago, moving in from North Carolina. Again, severe thunderstorm warning in effect for parts of Henry and Patrick counties until six o'clock. Main threat would be 60 mile per hour wind gusts. There could be some small hail in this as well, and there's torrential rains falling as well from Stewart out, say, south into areas, uh, say, near Mount Airy in North Carolina. Also notice in between Mount Airy and also Dan very uh, quite a few lightning strikes, so this is likely going to be a very electric and loud storm as it first moves into Patrick County and then will eventually impact you folks a little bit closer to Bassett here by 550 or uh, say six o'clock. Also dealing with some pretty heavy rain just to the east of Natural Bridge along Highway 130 south and in northern parts of Bedford County, uh, just perhaps to the west of Highway 122. As we put a track on this, it should be entering Buena Vista here. Uh, Buena Vista just dealt with some light rain. You're about to deal with some heavier rain within about the next six to ten minutes or so. Fairfield could be in line for this between say 540 and 545. The local view showing that all this is moving to the northeast at a clip of around about 25 to 35 miles per hour. The movement of these showers and thunderstorms today a little bit quicker than what they've been moving here over the last couple of days. Now a flood advisor as I told you at the top of the hour is in effect for parts of uh, Carroll and Patrick counties until 745. This is an anticipation of the heavy rain moving in from North Carolina and of course we have that flash flood watch in effect until 8 a.m. Friday for areas along and west of the parkway. You'll notice that so far the heaviest rain has kind of fallen along into the east of the parkway with some of the heaviest rain falling out across Campbell, Pennsylvania, Franklin, uh, Henry, uh, Carroll and also Patrick counties. These areas have seen anywhere between two and five inches of rain so far, and there's more coming here over the next 48 to 60 hours. Future trackers showing that we as we head into the evening hours, scattered showers and thunderstorms will dominate the forecast. Some heavy rain possible at say 10 1030 out across south side by around maybe one two o'clock in the morning may get a break from the heavier downpours. But as we head towards morning, more often on showers will form periods of rain and thunderstorms in the forecast off and on all day tomorrow. Tomorrow looks to be very, very wet at times for us. By later Thursday night may get a little bit of a break only to have more rain pushing in as soon as Friday morning. Now, as far as a flash flood threat is concerned, we're going to put that on the moderate level tonight, Thursday and Friday. So flash flooding will need to be monitored very closely, as will the threat for a few strong to even severe thunderstorms. But there is an end in sight and it comes this weekend. Finally, the stationary front will get on out of here by Saturday and Sunday. Not to say we're going to be completely dry those two days, but those two days will likely see a little more sunshine than what we've been seeing here of late. And also the chance for rain will go way down too. it's 85 Lynchburg 70 hot springs 70 in Withville, but 82 in Martinsville. It's much hotter towards south side because you've seen a little more sunshine today. Upper 70s Friday, mid to upper 80s Saturday and Sunday, near 90 Monday and Tuesday. Hit or miss thunder showers Saturday, only a minimal chance for a straight thunder shower Sunday through Tuesday. John.